Hey guys, welcome to your weekly tarot forecast for the Numinous. This is week beginning February the 8th. And in contrast to last week's little bit of lower level fire energy, a bit of drama and chaos, this week we have the King of Wands and he is really bringing back in the positive energy of the fire element. This is perfectly in line with today's new moon in Aquarius, which makes us need to think big, you know, huge ideas, aim high kind of energy. And I want to talk a little bit about that sense of thinking positively and really kind of upping our level of, you know, personal potential. Thinking positively doesn't make you more likely to receive a loss. All it does is give you a bigger space to actually see opportunities. So think of it as having 360 degree vision versus five degree vision or your kind of controlled space. When we open ourselves up to think, okay, maybe that's possible. Can I do that? You know, we're suddenly opening a bigger window rather than saying, you know, to ourselves, oh, you know, I really like to do that thing, but I can't, you know, putting ourselves in that smaller space so the king of wands he reminds us that we can really you know pull from that big expansive space of potential but of course we always want to put action you know into place as well but you know for the first half this week at least you know think any of you guys that like vision boarding i like to get on the floor and map out my brainstorming and you know go to that place like actually throw everything out of your mind because of course you know when we've got a lot of ideas it's easy to get overwhelmed by the stuff we want to do or things we want to call into our life and it's no use if we're then anxious because of the things we want right we want to get down get them out on paper so that we can actually see what we're looking at this is also a good week to brainstorm with your friends and perhaps bring in a little bit of accountability like I'm going to work on this week, I'm going to get this project started, what are you going to do? We're going to check in next week because remember with the fire element at its highest energy, it's passion, it's drive, it's you know focus, it's activism, it's being of service, it's sex, it's you know it's all that kind of charged energy and on its lower level it's judgment and comparison and all that kind of stuff. So remember when you're working with other people always collaborate rather than compete okay especially with your friends you know don't try and pull your friends down because you're feeling that kind of nag of jealousy if you're feeling that it's totally okay but it's your work to do because it's just reflecting something that you're afraid of you know lift each other up help each other out think of all the ways that you can be of service in the world because if you've got big ideas then perhaps you can be helping someone so really step into that charge of the fire energy this week and think big. I'll see you next week.